Legends, welcome back to the channel. John here with Crystal uh, today uh, with Proton 1.5 SE. And if you're watching this video, then it can only mean one thing. Uh, it means it's left the building, it's left the fleet. Um, I've got a young lad called Alex who's coming this afternoon uh, in about an hour's time to look at this Proton uh, with a view of him buying it for his collection. And I'm just doing a few pre-sale checks and just wanted to go through with you what I do uh, to a car before I sell it. Uh, because I want to make sure that it's safe. And obviously I also want to make sure that it's performing right before uh, I sell it on. Now, one thing I don't do is clean the engine bay to high heaven uh, because I want people to be able to see that it's an honest engine bay, that it's an honest car, and that actually I haven't mopped up any oil spills or any sort of problems. So the engine bay uh, is here. I've given it a quick blast off with compressed air, but apart from that, that is how it's going to be looking, and I'm not going to be doing anything else to that engine bay. One thing I am doing right now is topping up uh, the battery uh, because it's been stood a couple of weeks uh, just to make sure that the battery obviously is going to be up to scratch and isn't going to cause any sort of abnormal noises you know if the battery is weak it's going to put pressure on that alternator and the alternator belt and there's a potential then during a test drive that that is going to squeak and squeal uh, i'm going to make sure that coolant is topped up because it doesn't look like it's uh, all topped up there and i'm going to make sure the washer bottle is topped up too the battery then is on my smart charger 13.8 volts and um, it's going to be another hour or so on there not a problem i've just gone round and i've made sure all the tire pressures are okay and one thing i did promise alex that i would do is wax oil these arches uh, so i have just wax oiled all up here all up these arches just to form an extra layer of protection uh, between now and when Alex gets it home, I suppose. Um, Interior-wise, I've not done much to this car. I've not had a good clean of it. In fact, what I'm going to do is just turn, pull them out, uh, the keys out, so it's not going to potentially start up or have any sort of electrical uh, going through it, draining that battery while I'm charging it. Um, and yeah, that's it. I've not really done over much to this car. So we, we got it a couple of weeks ago. It came as part of the six car collection. Um, I've made sure that there's nothing in the car that I want to keep. Uh, I'm just going to double check again. There's nothing in here I want to keep. Uh, that's the handbook by the looks of things. Make sure it's the right one. Uh, make sure it's the right one. Yes, it's the right handbook for this car. So we'll keep that in there. Uh, I'm actually going to take these out in the AA handbooks uh, and this one because they're a nice period booklets and they'll go in the other car of mine so i'm keeping them sorry alex uh have a look in here make sure there's nothing yes ashtray and in there as well and in this ashtray cover as well nothing so that's the owner's manual that comes with the car um in fact i'm going to photograph these stickers because i don't have copies of those uh to replicate and then i am going to Make sure that everything is nice and clean and tidy for Alex. Um, people are going to be saying, John, why, why are you selling this car already? The honest answer is, uh, it deserves to go to a home that's going to enjoy it, that's going to look after it, that's going to throw a little bit of money towards it. Because it does, it does need a little bit of cash uh, injecting into it. And I can't keep it nice and dry, and I can't keep it uh, as good as it deserves to be. Um, I've enjoyed having it on the channel. Um, and I've enjoyed looking at it and actually there was a point where I did look at it and fall in love with it and think do you know what that's a beautiful thing um, but it just can't stay I like everything um, I've got my white saloon coming tomorrow and I've got my purple saloon that I need to get back on the road and this one just deserves that little bit of extra love so if you're watching this Alex has test driven it he's turned up and he's driven it away uh, if you're not watching this <laughs> the Lanx hasn't bought it, someone else has at a later date, uh, but I'll do an update in the description below. Let me know what you think. Uh, should I have kept it? Would you have bought it? What would you have done with it if uh, it was yours? Let me know in the comments below. If you've enjoyed the video, smash like, smash subscribe, and uh, if you haven't already done so, watch everything else on the channel. Have a great day. Until next time, take care, whatever you're getting up to, uh, and goodbye.